In this video, let us look into the different types of sets. Alright, here we've got the first kind of a set, which is called as an empty set. A set is said to be empty or null or void set if it has no element and it, and it is denoted by phi. And it, an example for the empty set can be, you know, just two flower brackets with nothing in between. So this is called as an empty set. All right. So let's look into another type of a set. So here is another kind of a set, which is called as a singleton set. What is it? A set consisting of a single element is called as a singleton set. Say, for example, just something between the two flower brackets, say A, just one element or say three or say some symbol theta. So these are singleton sets because it's just got one element irrespective of what element it is. So that is called as a singleton set. So let's go to the next type of set now. So the next kind of a set is a finite set. A finite set is nothing but it is this, a set is called a finite set if it is either void set or its elements can be listed by natural numbers or rather, you know, you can even replace the word listed by counted by natural numbers. So that is what it is. So you know why a void set or a null set or empty set is a finite set because you know for sure there are zero number of elements in it. All right, a singleton set is also a finite set because you know for sure there's just one element in it. You can definitely count, you know, say for a, for example, another example for a finite set can be one comma two comma three. So there are just three elements in that set. You can count the number of elements in the set by natural numbers. So that is why it's called as a finite set. But what cannot be an example of a finite set? Say, for example, this one comma two comma three comma dot dot dot. Well, this definitely cannot be an example for a finite set because the dot 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 says it goes on. So you cannot count for sure. So it it will probably come under an infinite set. So that is another kind of a set that I'm talking about. So when we talk about finite set, there automatically is another kind of a set, which is called as an infinite set. So an infinite set, an example can be this, you know, just a set of natural numbers, one comma two comma three comma dot 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 just keeps going on and on and on. It's not finite. So that is called as an infinite set. And these kind of sets are all called as finite sets. All right, then, so the types of sets are empty set, singleton set, and finite set. Well, when we talk about finite set, there also comes a set called as infinite set, which cannot be counted, which is pretty much understood. So that ends this video on types of sets. I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more concepts based on sets.